Hey y'all, it's Lane from Agrispray Drones and uh, today we're going to do a demonstrational video on how to take your motor pads off and disconnect your ESCs. And we're going to take a look at the motor mount itself and how it mounts. Alright, so the first step is going to be to take your motor pad off. Um, four screws in here. Two on each side. This is on the T40 by the way. Okay, now that you've done that, you're going to want to carefully take these off. These are very fragile. Very easy to break. They're just styrofoam. All right, now that's that's off. So now we have a clear look at our one of our ESC connections here. You're going to peel this rubber protector back. You're going to have two screws here, and then there's going to be two more in here whenever we take the ESC off this bracket. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to take the two screws on the top and two screws on the bottom off to get the ESC off of the bracket itself. Two there, two on the bottom. So then the ESC should just slide out of this bracket like so. So then you're gonna take and undo your two screws on this connection here. One on the bottom also. And then it should just simply unplug. Might have to wiggle it a little bit, just like that. And then it might help if you use a T-handle to get in here and take these other two screws out. This one, this back one might be a little tricky to get to. Well, we might have to try to pull the harness out just a little bit to get a better angle on that. There we go. Once that's done, it just should unplug like the other one. And there you go. Here's a good look at your T40 ESC and your plugs. So now we have the motor bracket itself. Um, so basically what you're going to want to do to remove the motor itself is probably take your props off first. Two nuts on the top. Take the prop off and the prop, um, I don't know, bracket, I guess. And then there's going to be four screws, one here, one here, one here, one here. And then you're going to disconnect your um, motor on the other side because the top one is this side and the bottom one is this side. So disconnect that and then the motor should just come right off. So um, yeah, that's basically all we got for you guys today. If you have any questions, text, call, or email, and uh, we'll see you on the next one. Thanks.